Hello everyone and welcome to my young and restless gossip channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Jordan discovers Claire's been released from the hospital and Michael gives Victor a warning. Devin arrives at Chancellor Winters, where Billy informs him he has to go out of town with Chelsea to check up on Connor. He's confronting some new challenges and he's going for moral support. Devin assured him it's not a problem. Don't worry about anything here. I'm positive we can keep things going without you. Billy can work from the road if anything comes up, but there's one provision he would like to make while he's away. Abby greets Kyle and Mariah at Society and thanks them for stopping in for breakfast. They converse about Tessa being zonked out at home after doing inventory. Abby believes it was a brilliant idea to hire her. Kyle says they'll mourn her at Jabot. Abby has to go check in with Devon and walks off. Mariah tells Kyle she's happy Tessa gets an opportunity to shine again whilst waiting for her voice to heal so she can go on the road again. Kyle asks how matters are with Mariah. She's great now that Arya is great. She's picking up words and making noises now. Kyle asks about her employment. Mariah says working with Sharon is wonderful and the company is strong. Kyle is delighted for her. She asks, okay, now you. She's sensing he's not so well. Kyle confesses part of him wishes he could steal his mom's job right out from underneath her. Kyle Abby Mariah YNR Mariah informs Kyle that was a bombshell. Kyle doesn't really want to steal his mom's position, but things aren't ideal right now. He recaps how he ended up in this position after acting out and taking a close look at himself. Kyle contemplates that he may have overcompensated for his bad behavior. He insisted that Diane take the role he desired, but he knows in his heart he deserves it. They discuss working with your family, which has pros and cons. Mariah assumes working with his mother isn't enough for him. Kyle acknowledges it's not, and the regret is driving him crazy. More, Cameron Grimes mourning a devastating loss. At the dive bar, Jordan looks at a text on her phone she sent to Seth inquiring if he's seen Nikki lately. She received no response. She sends another text saying she's concerned about her old friend. Jordan YNR At Newman, Victoria assures Victor she won't fight him anymore on his plan. She understands his logic, however she does have some conditions for her support. Victor promised he would keep Claire secure. Victoria has other conditions. Victor's glad Nikki was able to persuade her to see it his way. Victoria gops, what? She hasn't spoken to her mother since yesterday, it was Claire who altered her mind. That doesn't mean she's pleased about it. She complains about him placing her mother in a difficult position. Victor thinks she finds fault with everything he does. He's only attempting to keep the family safe. What's beneath all this? More, Jordan's plot could end, spoiler, s existence. Victor wonders if Victoria is upset that he promoted her siblings when she walked away. Victoria only took a break because her daughter required her. She's not harboring private resentment regarding work. If she's frustrated with him, it has nothing to do with the company. Victor figures there's nothing else to argue about then. He goes over them having to exhibit a united front. Michael Victoria YNR Michael comes in and announces that the judge has determined that Claire can be remanded to Victoria and Cole's custody. Victoria exclaims, they're letting her come home? She worries it will be too overwhelming and reminds her father he has to defend her. Michael muses, so, you're on board. Victoria claims she is, but not without misgivings. She will give Claire the news herself. Victoria reminds Victor he has to keep Claire secure and there can be no surprises. I want her staying with me at my home. Victor doesn't want that. He wants them to stay at the estate where he can provide security. You'll both be safe, I promise you. Victoria agrees, but it's only provisional until Jordan is back in custody. At the dive bar, Jordan wonders where Seth is and why he hasn't gotten back to her. She thinks of something in beans. More, Eric Braden helps MTS celebrate her Nikki-versary. 
At Chancellor Winters, Billy requests Devin to keep Chance in the loop while he's away. Devin queries why when he's going to be available. Billy thinks it's an opportunity for Chance. Devin doesn't believe it's appropriate, but that's Billy's business. Abby comes in and Billy departs as Devin says he hopes everything works out for the best. Once alone, Abby detects that the tension between him and Billy hasn't let up. Devin thinks Billy wants Chance to be his fly on the wall, so nothing occurs without him knowing about it. He's not positive when Lily's coming back, so he has to figure out how to work with Billy in the meantime. Abby knows this can be taxing, she worked with Phyllis. Billy couldn't possibly be that awful. Devin believes they're equally bad in their own ways. He's glad Billy's gone out of town. Things will operate smoother. Abby Devin YNR At Crimson Lights, Billy informs Chelsea he's ready to go. He can see she's apprehensive and assures her she's doing everything she can right now. She's just afraid of what the therapist will say. Billy says she'll get through it and he'll be there every step of the way. Chelsea asks if he's positive he wants to come. She assumes Devin was annoyed that he's leaving. Billy tells her Devin wished them the best with Connor. Chelsea thinks that's lovely, but knows there's more to it. Billy admits to the tension between them, but refuses to stay behind. Billy Chelsea YNR Just then, Adam comes in. I figured we would take my car. Is Billy here to see you off? Billy says he's driving Chelsea. Adam says it's a private family matter. Chelsea argues that Connor doesn't see Billy as an outcast. They need to focus on the meeting. Adam agrees, and Billy and Chelsea warn that they need to be on the same page. Adam informs Billy that he doesn't need him to tell him how to father his own son. Adam Billy Chelsea YNR Billy steps aside with Adam and tells him he made a remark because he's looking out for Connor, not telling him how to parent. Adam asks if this is how he intends to console Connor, by insulting his father. Chelsea interrupts and reminds Adam that Sharon told them to take this one step at a time and not rush to conclusions. They have to heed to the specialist. Connor doesn't need to sense the tension between them. If they can't regulate themselves, then maybe they should both stay home. More, Mark Grossman brings girlfriend on ski trip. Victoria and Cole arrive at Memorial and inform Claire the judge has granted her freedom. You're coming home with us. Claire doesn't know how to react. I've never been out there the way I am now. She's excited and frightened. Cole believes nerves are normal. Claire frets about Jordan. Victoria assured her they'll be right there by her side. This is a journey to finding her true self and being whole. Claire marvels at thinking of it that way. Her whole existence has been about getting justice for something that didn't even happen. There are so many options. I just want to get it right. Claire Victoria Cole YNR At Society, Mariah urges Kyle to grant himself a break. He had an extremely difficult year. Have you thought about your part in any of that? Kyle hasn't. Mariah suggests he do that. Kyle says Summer broke his heart and his dad selected her over him and Billy refused to vacate his co-CEO position. Mariah isn't buying him as just a victim. He's made choices every step of the way and needs to own them. Maybe it will give him an opportunity to see this as a new beginning. Kyle taunts Mariah about tearing him down before sending him on a journey. Mariah just wishes him to live without regrets. He concedes he needs to reflect so he doesn't make the same errors again. Kyle Mariah YNR at Chancellor Winters, Abby massages Devon's back. She can't leave now. Even though Billy is gone, she wishes him to be happy. Devon is pleased he gets to go home to her every day. Abby wishes him to be happy all the time. She'll help him relieve the stress and tension. They embrace. More, YNR has a jaw-dropping romantic twist ahead.